Many dogs enjoy playing in the water, but the breeds on this list were bred for the water, and they truly love H2O. If you're looking for a swimming partner or a pup to hang out in the pool with, these 10 pooches are for you. Let's get started. But before we start, take a moment to like and subscribe for more fun fauna facts. Number 10. Standard Poodle. The Standard Poodle derives its name from the German word Poodle, which means to splash. While many think the Poodle lives on the dog show circuit, the truth is this dog was born for the hunt. He is a retriever. His job was to fetch waterfowl from the water for his hunting companion. He may appear dainty, but the Standard Poodle is a swimming expert, and many hunters still use him for retrieving ducks and other waterfowl. Number 9. Newfoundland. The giant Newfoundland breed was a popular working dog, both on land and water on the island of Newfoundland off the east coast of Canada. I wonder where he got his name. Among his soggier duties were towing lines from ship to land in choppy seas and rescuing swimmers. In fact, he was so adept in his ability to save the drowning that there was once a time when Newfoundland dogs were required at lifeguard stations along the British coast. The Newfoundland is strong and able to be used as a drafting dog as well. Number 8 Chesapeake Bay Retriever The Chesapeake Bay Retriever is often regarded as the toughest of the water retrievers. The Chesapeake Bay Retriever dog breed originated as a water dog used to hunt and retrieve ducks in the Chili Chapa, Maryland's Chesapeake Bay. Many Chessies, as they are sometimes called, actually swim and dive into icy cold water. This is probably because his coat, which is nearly waterproof, consists of a dense undercoat and a rough, wind-resistant outer coat. Similar in appearance to the Labrador Retriever, the Chesapeake Bay Retriever is still an excellent hunting and swimming dog today. Don't assume your dog can swim just because his breed is mentioned here. Every dog will need to take some time to feel comfortable in the water. Also, you should teach your dog how to get out of the water should he become tired or panicked. Be careful of dangerous creatures in or around bodies of water. Your dog could seem like a tasty snack for animals like alligators, snakes, or sharks. Parasites and bacteria may also harm your dog. Use caution when taking your dog to unfamiliar bodies of water and speak with a veterinarian should he seem sick after a swim. Number 7 English Setter The English Setter often feels more at home in the water than on land. He was originally bred as a bird dog to point and retrieve game in the soggy English moors. Setters, as a type of hunting dog, were known in England as long as 400 years ago. The English setter is still used as a hunting dog today, as well as a family companion. Number 6 Irish Water Spaniel one of the largest and oldest of the Spaniel breeds still around today, the Irish Water Spaniel was originally bred as a sporting dog and water retriever. The Irish Water Spaniel is a native Irish breed dating back at least a thousand years. His beautiful double coat and tight curls help resist harsh outdoor conditions, but he may be a bit difficult to acquire as he is a relatively rare breed. Number 5 Irish Setter the result of combining the best traits from several breeds including the English Setter, the Pointer, the Irish Terrier, and the Irish Water Spaniel, the Irish Setter has just as much fun out in the field as in the water. Like the previously mentioned English Setter, the Irish Setter was bred for hunting, specifically for setting or locating and pointing upland game birds. He is a tireless, wide-ranging hunter and well-suited to fields and wet or dry moorland terrain. Number 4 Portuguese Water Dog Once found all along the coast of Portugal, the Portuguese Water Dog was used mainly to herd fish into nets, retrieve lost fishing equipment, and act as a boat-to-boat -boat or boat-to-shore courier. Nowadays, the Portuguese Water Dog is just as happy playing in a backyard pool. Number 3 Nova Scotia Duck Tolling Retriever The smallest of the retrievers, the Nova Scotia Duck Tolling Retriever was originally bred in the southern region of Nova Scotia, Canada to toll, lure, and retrieve waterfowl by playing on shore. The name Toller is derived from his ability to lure waterfowl within range of a hunter's shots. 
He is particularly suited for retrieving in cold water climates because of his water repellent double coat. Number two. Labrador Retriever. America's most popular dog also happens to be one of the best swimming dog breeds. This is probably because the modern Labrador Retriever is the ancestral result of a popular fishing and retrieving dog from Newfoundland and Labrador, an Atlantic coastal province in Canada near the Labrador Sea. Today, he is a ubiquitous family companion, and other than retrieving, has found work in other fields such as a guide dog and even police work, thanks to his nearly unmatched trainability. We publish every Monday and Friday, so hit that notification icon to not miss a single fact. Number 1 Golden Retriever The Golden Retriever, a cousin of the Labrador, was originally bred as a hunting companion for retrieving waterfowl. He continues to be a favorite among hunters and families who want a dog who loves to swim. The Golden Retriever's friendliness has made him popular as a disability assistance dog, such as being a guide dog for the blind and a hearing dog for the deaf. In addition, they are trained to be a hunting dog, a detection dog, and a search and rescue participant. Want more fun final facts? Go ahead and smash that subscribe button and hit the notification icon to not miss a single fact. If you like this video, go ahead and hit that like button. Hey, this button works. Well, that other button also works. If you'd like to help us grow, consider becoming a patron on Patreon or clicking the PayPal link on animalfacts.us. And as always, catch you next time.